hello and uh, welcome I'll just share with you a quick tip how how to do uh, the FBX uh, merging in one file so let's say that we have uh, let's search for an FBX file no sorry import in FBX let's say we have this source shark FBX accept and import and just wait for it till it uh, hold so if we go inside we see all this big mess for the file this is the file by the way what about the material do we have material let's, let's add I'll add material later on but uh, let's say this is the file these are the nodes these are the first nodes and what about this one it's this one and the base this one so these are the nodes that if I go inside it still I have each part separated so to make it easy to work with I select all of this Control C, object. Let's create another object. Oh, sorry, another geometry. I'll hide this one. And here I do object merge. And here I paste all of it. Now it's here. But this is uh, time consuming. Another way to do it is by using uh, this python script I will share it in the description it's a python I remove some of the lines that uh, was giving me error between 18.5 and Houdini 19 so I remove these lines so it's working with Houdini 19 python 3 so how how to use it let me first show you what it will do so I select these points I go to merge FBX, this is the one, and I press. So, it already did the merge for me. Took each one, geometry, assign its material, if there is material, and a specific color, merge them, normal. Now, how to set up this one? How to make it like a note like this so we have uh, the shelf upstairs so let's say this one I do right click new tool now in the new tool in the script here control a control C control V so it's here make sure it's not a script it's Python a script will give you it see error it was written in Python. Here I can name the tool the name I want. I can change the icon for it. And I can assign a hotkey if I want. And I press apply and accept. So here it is. Uh, another good tool to know about let's say this is deleted. Before I delete them, it's Align them, you know, align. Layout, align, horizontal. Yeah. So. See? So. I select the uh, nodes I want. I press A. Up, it will align up. Up, it will align up. Up. It doesn't work. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So, let's just disconnect this one. Guess I want to say uh, to merge all these together. Either we'll go here, we'll press merge. 
add it and you press one by one or you select all of them result and drag now you have it here another cool feature let's say i want to add null i just press null i want to add object merge object merge and as transform transform instead of going to the menu and then to do it is the same way i added a, a key here just delete this one like uh, for instance like i want to add the uh, uh, one of the nodes one of the nodes i go like this right click here on this on this one edit chill tool tab and on the tool go all the way for like say for transform see this other node i selected so for null there is null top dob object bob and sub you choose one like object merge you have object merge for the sub level for the chop level and transform so all the all the notes so all the notes in houdini are shown up here okay you can see so these are the notes i just used like if i am in uh, dob network and i want to add merge so if i do the merge sub it will give me a sub merge but i select alt and make it the merge for the dob network so these are some of the cool networks so if i'm in here and i put null see from here and i put object merge created here this is say i have uh, rbd material and uh, there is rbd solver i put it here so as you can see these have lines like this so instead of connecting one by one one by one what you can do you can pressing shift with this one see the line press here the line press here the line and connect so it connected it together so it's faster how to delete use y with j you can select j select j i'm pressing j like if we have two nodes null and null and null by pressing j select j it select y remove remove so y i repeat this shift so i press shift this one and this one and i put like this so it's selected here pressing r will uh, focus the flag on it r by pressing r so thank you very much this was a quick one thank you